Um, one of our programs, the Willpower Program, um, it's a program we deliver in all remote, remote communities of South Australia and the Barkner region of Northern Territory. And uh, yeah, we made the trek up with the team. Um, we're here at Elliot for day one, so really excited to be in Elliot, which is obviously a good connection with us in the Port Adelaide Football Club and having Jake Need as one of our players, but also seeing his family and his mum in the school. It's always a really good moment for us as a club and, and as a program. It's been my passion since I was a young person. I grew up in a remote community myself and know the challenges that comes with living in a remote space. And yeah, I think it's just been a wonderful um, opportunity that the club, you know, Port Adelaide have given me to be able to bring my mindset to, to this program and you know and, and exactly what you're saying about what, what makes me tick is, is often just the smile and you know we're seeing that here today all the beautiful smiles on these young people and you know we know that that's the impact that we're having as a club and, and bringing in staff and players to actually play a good role modelling role up here for them so I love it, I love being up here, I love being in remote remote communities, my real passion so yeah I feel really fortunate. <laughs> Kids are so excited because they don't have this opportunity often. All that leadership stuff that you talk about is what we talk about in the classroom, being a strong leader for the community. Um, it, it just empowers the kids and, and you can see that they're, they're thinking about, well, you know, I can get a good job, I can come to school every day and we do have high attendance and the kids are, you know, really really study hard. 2016 we did 65,000 kilometres in the Willpower program so you know you're looking at going around the world three times you know so it's some it's a it's a it's a massive massive effort from the team to be able to get out to some of these remote communities I mean after all which sits on the Northern Territory Queensland border um, you know there, there's some really long kilometres Oak Valley in South Australia is probably one of the remotest, remotest communities in Australia so we do a hell of a lot of um, kilometres to, to get to these communities, but we know we can't wait to get to them, so it doesn't have an impact. Our team and I, we love travelling, we love being in the car and getting on the road and seeing the red dirt everywhere. It's nothing, nothing brings us more satisfaction knowing that we're actually um, travelling in a remote space. So if we can do that, I think it's a, it's a small, it's a small um, incentive for us considering these guys live so far out. So for us to get, be able to get out here, I think that's, that's really important.